I'm farming dopamine, or at least I'm trying. Sometimes we farm acetylcholine. <laughs> Pokemon Direct tomorrow? Oh, now we're talking. Uh, what the heck am I doing? This is it's just garbage already. Um, hold on. Takes a second to get the, the old brain working. Early in the morning here, roughly. <laughs> if you're ever able to say it's early in the morning when it's 11 a.m., it's, it's during real baby hours. You know what? We gotta do this. It's just gotta be done. And then we can do it again. Bop, bop, and I'll do it again. Bop, bop. I don't know where the heck we're putting this one, though. You know what? Sometimes you just gotta own it. Hey, I'm, I'm not thrilled. I'm not thrilled with our current setup here. In case you, you look at this and you say he must be proud of this, you would be very incorrect. I did see, okay, so this is what I was going to say. Thank you, Brain, for returning my, my thought to me. Um, I did see there's a Sony State of Play today, and I thought about, like, hey, we could, like, co-stream the State of Play. But then I looked, and the State of Play is only, uh... It's, like, two hours long or something? Or, uh, sorry, half an hour long? Much different. <laughs> and I was like, come on, half an hour? I don't get out of bed for anything less than an hour and a half now. It's not enough. And then it was like, we're not going to announce anything new, we're just going to give you an update on how Ratchet and Clank is going. And I'm like, I, that's not for me. That's that's not my kind of content. We're going to lose. If you, don't, if you don't straighten up and fly right here, we're going to lose. Half an hour of announcing delays for games. Hey, you know, like... Maybe it's not what people want to hear, and admittedly, I have no actual knowledge of essentially how the industry works at all. Um, and unlike many streamers, I won't pretend that it's the opposite. Um, however, if there was ever a year for kind of understandable delays, certainly feels like this might be the one, right? Figuring out how to handle all the, the work from home and the... I'm sure it's an adjustment for a lot of industries, but the, at least the gaming industry, you know, you're dealing with, like, mostly digital assets and stuff like that. But at the same time, I'm sure it's, uh, you know what? Sure, sure, send it. <clears throat> at the same time, I'm sure it's, uh, you know, it's a new era. The top ten version of this song is unforgivable. You're, you're gonna laugh, but I don't know if, if you've been in the comments for, uh... The Tetris 99 VODs, but I, I said some not-so-nice things about this theme. I said it was, uh... It's art for people who hate art. It has no merit. There's no reason for it to exist. Uh, it offers no value to society. And it only exists to fill space. And, uh... I, I can't imagine why some people took offense to that. <laughs> and... <laughs> They were like, shut up, uh, this is my favorite song. And I think they were, I don't know, they might have been a little disingenuous, but I think that they actually do enjoy the song. Just goes to show you, you know, there's, there's no accounting for taste. People with bad taste in, in all avenues of life. You know what, okay, put it down there, and then there, and then there. And then there, okay, but get me off of attackers. That's just, that's a bad habit right there. Starting to feel it coming back. It's slow, but watch me go. It's slow, but watch me go. Then you build there. Mm. Then you build here, and we got a couple of attackers, so we're gonna go back and you plan for the future. You get one of those in there, one of these, one of these, and then you follow it up with a simple one of those. And look at that, that's a solid combo. And we got our two wide back. You want to do this, this, this. We're looking for a long piece, please. Long piece perfectly fills the gap. This is honestly kind of a nice run right now. Um, life comes at you fast, don't get me wrong. But we got, we got some good stuff going on here. I, I can't be too disappointed. One of the attackers bled off. I was just going to say, they got a little scared. They got a little scared, and I, I can't blame them. Now, I'm a little scared, to be honest with you. We had to build on the garbage hole, I think. Uh, or at least I, I, I couldn't come up with a way not to. It's a more accurate way of saying that. I, I couldn't come up with a way not to do it. Mmm. Has to be done. Okay, I, I see our way out of this. It's not beautiful. 
It's not beautiful. Don't kill me. Ah, I could have put it down. I could have put it down. <laughs> if you search Tetris 99 school theme, NL is fifth on the list. Hey, give me a... We haven't, we haven't earned a... Uh, a school theme yet. We have to be punished in order to get a school theme. We at least at least give me a time to in, enjoy a little classic. Beep 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 beep. Yeah, you can't enter a flow state with this theme. I I agree. I agree a hundred percent. I'm actually I w I wouldn't say I'm disappointed, but um, fifth on the list. How many people are searching Tetris 99 school theme? It's, it's probably cost me viewers. Imagine if we ranked fifth for uh, for Dogecoin. Oh my god. What are you drinking? I know it's suspicious because it's in like a, a clear tumbler. Um, so you think I got some kind of, like, I, I got lean in here, or something like that. It's not the case. Um, can I, so I'm, I've, I've been doing, <laughs> it's such a, it's a very me bit, okay? But just let me work on it here. Um, it's, cause it's not a bit, it's actually, like, my life. Um, I've been doing my taxes, right? And, and thankfully, like, that's all done now. Um, but... I got, like, important documents in my office from time to time, and I got paranoid that my previous water bottle was, like, too reflective. And, you know, rather than tempt fate and, like, accidentally, uh, you know, show a reflection of, like, my social insurance number or something like that, I was like, let's get a more, um... Let's get a more opaque, sort of, like, a less reflective bottle. That That's... and. When I told Kate that, she just laughed at me. And I just accepted the, her laughter, because I was like, it, I know, it's maybe a little overly paranoid. <laughs> or a lot overly paranoid, but, uh, you know. It's, it's less, like, when you have delusions like that, it's much less about, like, is this realistic? And much more about, like, you know, your own peace of mind. Like, the odds of it happening... Oh, this is going real well so far. The odds of it happening are, are fairly low, I think, but at the same time, you're just like... Oh my god. You know, better, better safe than sorry, or at the very least, I could, like, you know, not have to worry about it if I just take two seconds out of my day. Yeah, exactly. So we're, we're getting... Uh, w without a doubt, we're getting badge targeted right now. But that's actually not so bad. In fact, it, it might even be good. Because it means that we're actually... Uh, we're gonna get a lot of aggression. The, the catch is you gotta survive the aggression. But if you're able to survive the aggression, you're, you're gonna be a mighty happy camper, I think. Yeah, this is okay. Even though we got a, a, a long-term garbage debt, I'm not sweating this too much. We're looking for an orange. Orange received. We're looking for a blue. I mean, we're sending a, a staggering amount of garbage here. Not even looking at the pieces anymore, man. I'm like, I, I know what's coming. You don't need to tell me what's coming. You don't need to tell me what's coming. And I'm still hitting the button. Still so many attackers, huh? Looking for a long piece? Long piece? Or a uh, fat piece? That's what I meant. Oh, and then one of these. And one of those. One of these. Quick one of those will get you right. Okay. Now we're talking. <laughs> what did I tell you? I told you we were talking. And you know what? We're in such a good position. I'm not going to let that uh, put a damper on things. The number of games I have won while also uh, misplacing pieces is equal to the number of games I've won. The numbers are one and the same. So we're, we're choosing not to sweat that. Only got one attacker. Get me out of here. We, we, we want high value targets only. Long piece. Gonna help us alleviate our garbage hole concerns. You mining garbage, you little shit? Beautiful. You go orange. Ooh, that's not orange. <laughs> Wait a minute, hold on. 
I was just, I, I was examining for a brief moment how things looked, and I've decided they could look a little better. Although that was pretty sweet. I don't know how we, I mean, we didn't earn a badge there. I'll take one. An unearned badge grants garbage nonetheless. I apologize, because this is kind of like a... It's a classless way to respond. But this is, without a doubt, the least deserved, like, decent run we've ever had. <laughs> we need two long pieces, please. I see it, I see it. It's coming back. It's coming back. There you go. I think we would have gotten out of that even without the long pieces, but I'm certainly glad we got them. Okay, we need another long piece as well. Good. Good. This is a builder. This is a Bob. Bob the Builder's still around? Or is that like, am I a million years old? Like, are kids still watching that the same way... You know, Sesame Street is still a thing? Or is is that like ancient history at this point? I'm gonna I'm gonna say I'm gonna answer my own question. I'm pretty sure it's probably ancient history. Good combo. Great combo to get us out of there. 75% up is is an incredible position to be in. Still not sweating it, like not sweating it at all. It is a lot of garbage, don't get me wrong. It's starting to get a little real. It's starting to feel a little realer. We gotta do it, I hate to do it. That's huge, that's huge. That's huge. <laughs> oh! Okay, so things got a little spicy. But now we're feeling pretty good. Don't give me a T-spin sound for that. Go one tile just for a bit. Don't build too much on the garbage hole. You know how it goes. I don't see a long piece. I'm so stupid. You gotta put pieces down. Just put some pieces down. This is the end of our days. And we deserve it. That's the worst part. The worst part about all this. Just let me put one piece. Oh. Just the worst. I, I, I was like... We beat the stank. I'll take it there. We beat the stank. In my head, I was like, should I put a blue piece, like an L, in the in the garbage uh, spot? And I said, no. I said, we'll wait for a long piece. Then I looked to the right, and I saw that there was no long piece coming. And I said to myself, okay, let's put the blue piece in there. By the time I did it, there was there was a Z right on top of the, right on top of the pit. Certainly a great run, though. Say it myself, you know, I, you already know where I'm gonna come at this one from. Some people are always trying to ice skate uphill. I, I have no place to put this piece. <laughs> Doesn't happen that often. It, it's a sign that, oh my god. It's a sign that you've built badly when you have no place to put like your first pieces. But I'm not, I'm not sweating. I'm not sweating the current position we find ourselves in. The more aggression you got early, the easier your life could be in just a bit. Takes a minute. Sometimes it takes a minute. You gotta wait for the f like. It's it's one of those things you gotta you gotta shake out the paper hands, right? I know you guys love the uh, the rhetoric. You gotta shake out the paper hands. So we're shaking out the paper hands. People that have no confidence in their position right now, and then. Even the most diamond of diamond hands will start to bleed off a little bit here. I I hate to do it. It's you know it's it's just science. 
There's a simple science to it, a simple calculus, if you will. As soon as you see, people start to lose confidence right around here, they're like, I'm not sure if I actually can handle this. He looked like an easy target, but now things are looking somewhat more complicated. And if I'm looking at his stream, which they guaranteed are, by the way, um, look at that, he's got a nice little two-tile, and some people are like, don't get out, you cowards, that's how you lose. You only lose when you get out, but they're like, sorry, uh, I'm out of here. See you later. And you know what? You gotta do right by yourself, right? That's the thing. You don't think you can hang? You shouldn't be invested right here. Because we're, we're, we're going to the moon. You can either be with us or you can be against us. Stream snipers. Today's not your day, okay? I, I built a little garbage in the garbage hole. Sure, it happens from time to time. And then, you know, we still got some people thinking they got a shot here. It's up to us to prove them wrong. Something like that goes a long way towards making that happen. No, it's a meme. I don't I don't think I mean it's it's I'm sure some degree of sniping happens in Tetris 99, but if if anything, it's probably much more likely to be sniping to get in the same lobby. It's really hard to uh actually snipe what a you know, like the person's actual board unless you got some degree of coordination going on. And I I wouldn't uh I wouldn't assume that I can foster that level of uh, community, either in my community or in, in communities elsewhere. Alright, sorry, I lost my focus there while I was uh, bantering. Time to get back, do a little extra damage to the stream snipers. What do we have, 50? 50 is pretty good. 50% damage up. One of these. I, we got that long piece in reserve, so you get something like this going. And it's... Uh, is a good thing. It's a very good thing. Something like that. You know what? I'll even break that wide open right here. I don't mind busting that wide open. We needed one of those, so I'm very appreciative. Still playing a little slow, though. Could be playing a little faster. I was just gonna say, I think 75 is in our future. Can I get 75? 75, please? There's 75. Okay. Nice fix. It looks bad, but I promise you this is actually a good fix right here. Ooh, that's not, though. Okay, hold on. Just chill. Everything's still okay. So you got one of those burning a hole in your pocket. This is where you just make lines quickly. If you can make lines quickly, you're going to go far. Um, okay, I hate this. I regret everything. But you know what? Not, not a terrible uh, way to pull ourselves out of that. And, I mean, as long as nobody's sending you threats, you don't have to feel threatened. Oh, here we go. Okay. The brain has started making connections again. Very much appreciated. I see some badge lords that are... I'm not gonna say they're in a vulnerable position. I'm not gonna say they're they're asking to be yeeted from the game. All I'm saying is... If... You know, it's like being a car salesman. What can I do to get you out of your badges today? Thank you, thank you. Much appreciated. What's it gonna take to get you out of your badges? You want the true coat? You want the free uh, rust guard? It's my job. My job is to get you out of those badges today. If I can do that, I consider myself a happy man. Consider myself fulfilled. Okay, at some point, <laughs> all memeing aside, we may want to burn off some of the aggression that we've managed to muster here. It's not too hot yet, but it's starting to get a little spicy. We can do that, and then it's not the best long piece you're ever going to see, but to keep the combo rolling... We don't sweat it. Okay, so obviously, I mean, like, you don't need me to tell you this. We want to get plus 100. We got a ways to go to get there. Fourteen KOs last game. I, I, I am a little surprised we may be able to beat 14 KOs this time. Okay, it's, it's starting to travel a little fast. Starting to go a little faster. That's fine, that's fine. Just chill. 
You're doing great. Sometimes you, you might say, why is he saying just chill so much in, in such a high octane game? I'm telling you. Sometimes just giving yourself the permission, kind of hang back a little bit and be like, you know what? Not, not every uh, placement has to be an absolute slam dunk. Radio silence, by the way. It, it's beneficial. Radio silence. I don't like this well. There we go. There we go. Has to change. Both on me, huh? You know, no no offense taken. That's big. Why are you still spinning? <laughs> So bad. Oh, so much worse. Okay, just chill. Just chill. This is just chill meta. Soundtrack, are you okay? I need a long piece, man. PP long piece? If you're gonna... if <laughs> Fine, fine. You know what? It's the greatest throw of all time. It's actually the... It, it was such an easy win. It was such an easy win. <laughs> we died. We died to the game. We actually died to Tetris. I can't imagine... When was the last time that happened? I feel like Pablo. Sorry, get more lean in the system there. <clears throat> oh, did I, I spell dopamine wrong? Okay, again, you know, let, let's get that going. Dope, dopamine Thursday. Thank you, thank you. Heavy, heavy correcting the teacher energy, but you know what? We're gonna let that uh, roll off, roll off our back. <clears throat> get him, teach. Anyway, long story short. Is Bob the Builder still a thing? Like, nobody answered my question. I've been waiting for an answer. For, for several minutes and have received none. He got rebooted. Dude, I think we've entered a new era of, like, um, of reboots. Or of, at least of, like, reboot energy. And I know you're going to be like, what are you talking about? Let me explain myself, okay? Um, 
the Rugrats is getting rebooted. I fully expected to, to step into the uh, Twitter thread and see a bunch of people my age going like, I can't believe they would ruin my childhood with something like this. Actually, when I went into the thread, it was just a bunch of people that were complaining about co people complaining that they said it ruined their childhood despite those people having actually not been in the thread in the first place. And I was like, you know what? Maybe that's the first step. It was, it was like second order. It was like, I'm just here to see all the people who say their childhood's ruined, but none of them were there. That's a start, you know? I think, uh... You know, people my age, we're, we're, we're getting a little bit better, you know? No longer are we like... I, I guess we're coming to terms with the fact that we're no longer, uh... You know, the youngest generation on planet Earth, and as a result, you know, kids' shows... You know, they're not for you anymore. Don't, don't worry about it so much. Bob the Builder was made to get more people into construction because at the time there was a dearth of workers for it. Um, so here's the thing. I'm going to hit you with something. I don't know if that's actually true. It seems like one of those things that like is designed to make you assume that it's true without actually triggering your desire to uh, think about it critically. Um, however, even if that's the case, I think that's kind of cool. I, I've said it before, but like... I do feel like when I went to school, there was, like, book smart propaganda. That was, like, you know, it, it looked down on people that worked in the trades and was like, oh, that's only for people who aren't book smart. The idea that there's, a, uh, You know, I, uh, I mean, there's all sorts of uh, content that's out there, like, trying to get people to become, you know, scientists and paleontologists and something like that as well. Why, why not more content to... You know, have people become uh, you know, laborers and construction workers and or, or even just to, like, feel that being good with your hands is cool or something like that, you know? Like, I remember I, I read a post, I, this is years ago, but I read a post on Reddit that was like, you know, my parents explained it to me like this. And they, they phrase it as if it's a good thing, but I'm like, I think it's pretty messed up. My parents were like, you know, you can either, like, get a job where you shower before work, or you can get a job where you shower after work. And you should work as hard as you can to get a job where you shower before work, and you don't have to shower after work. It was just, like, a weird, um, kind of, like, elitist, like, you know, I don't do a job that makes you sweaty. And I'm like, I can understand, you know, why you wouldn't want to, but at the same time, it's such a weird, like... <laughs> I just wonder how they're feeling about it now, I guess, so I'm like, if anything, um, I, I mean, I wouldn't say, like, I look upon it with envy, but I think if I had, had gone, like, in the, the, the way that, uh, you know, my career would have gone if the miracle of YouTube hadn't existed, um, you know, probably I would be, like, working uh, at an office, like, with a job that I didn't really like all that much. Would I be sitting there going like, oh, at least I don't have to shower uh, after work or something like that? <laughs> I think I would be looking at some of the people I went to high school with who now have like, you know, they they, they paid their dues as like, you know, journeymen, uh, plumbers or electricians or whatever. And, and uh, I would be like, you know what? I think they actually kind of, they kind of had it figured out. It depends, I mean, on top of that, you know, it depends what you want, don't get me wrong. But, I, I think that the idea that one is just strictly, like, superior to the other is uh, a little bogus. Dude, we should banter more often. This was like... I can't believe we got ourselves out of the pit there. It's true, I guess if you work an office job right now, you don't have to shower at all. I don't think the spirit of the of the commentary, by the way, was that showering is uh, annoying. We're, we're super dead. We just... It's too much aggression. Yeah, it's just too much aggression. <laughs> I'm 
still gotta look well on video calls. Have you considered uh, shaving your head? If you just shave your head, uh, then you, you never have to shower. Like, you don't know, you look at me right now. Did I shower before work? Maybe yes, maybe no. I know. <laughs> How many wins do you have since coming back to Tetris? I think I got like six or seven. I think it's like beginner's luck is like a real thing when you're like super focused at the start. So I think I came in being like, oh, I'm never going to get another win. Um, and then I got a bunch of wins from like having a chip on my shoulder. And then I got a little like, you know, lackadaisical. That's why sports psychology is like a, a real thing. No, hold on. Yeah, yeah, that's the ticket. That's the combo piece right there. Plus, I mean, you know, when, when Michael Jordan is in the middle of, uh, you know, trying to win an NBA championship, he's not talking about, like, you know, divisive uh, issues in terms of labor uh, and, the, and the perception they're in. Um, in fact, he doesn't talk about that stuff until, like, 30 years later in the, in the documentary. And it turns out he took it personally. That's that's all I know about the documentary. I haven't seen it yet, but apparently he takes it personally. He has a god complex. I mean, have you seen the man play basketball? He's really, really good at basketball. He's he's one of the top two or three basketball players of all time. He's really good. Is he better than God at basketball? Could God make a baller so dank that even he could not beat the baller? I don't know. It's a question that, you know, many, many smarter people than myself have been asking for a long time. I don't know what I'm doing here. I, I have I've built myself a tomb. <laughs> and now it's time to die. <laughs> it's actually as far as tombs go, that was a pretty good one. Um, we got ourselves out of that quite nicely. But we're doing we're literally just rebuilding the tomb once more. Um, so let's, let's try to break it down a little. Sometimes you can break it down like thus, like this, I should say. Good KO. Honestly, we deserve that. There was, there was more creativity there than the average, uh, pullback. Long piece. Long piece. The long piece comes down. We are in a little Tetris drought, though. We haven't won, like, we didn't win the entire last, uh, session. So I'm, I'm definitely, you know, I'm, I'm kind of eager to get rid of the snake bite here, but... You know, slumps are, are real things, man. Like, like personally, professionally, it happens all the time. It takes, uh, you know, it happens to the best of us, and it, it, it takes a little elbow grease to get yourself out of it. Doesn't matter if you're Elias Pettersson, the... You know, preeminent talent in today's uh, National Hockey League. Ah, sometimes you just gotta. Sometimes you just gotta. Feeling a win today? Love, love to see it. Love to see it. Doubters be gone. Slumps aren't real. It's just variance. Wait, it's all math. Yep, always has been. I don't think you can T-spin that. I, I thought about it. Um, I thought about it. It, it seemed a little over-ambition. Or over-ambitious to me. I don't think the math worked out. It's just variance. A, a single line of garbage... Like, you might as well have gotten me a Christmas present. A single line of garbage is like... It, you know what it is? It's like the Tetris vaccine. It's exactly uh, enough of a threat perceived in order to generate a response without actually having any danger as well. Okay, I guess I shouldn't say any danger, but you know what I mean. 
I suppose I could have an allergic reaction to the one line of garbage. There's a one in, you know, two million chance. Something along those lines. But, like, for the most part... <laughs> I, I thought that said I'm going to get my vaccine in three days, yay, and I was going to be mad. Instead, it said I'm going to get my vaccine in, like, three years, and I was like, ah, oh, jeez Louise. Hey, but at least you don't have, like, that one guy calling your province, like, unless you live in BC. Uh, you know, the Florida of, of Canada? And he didn't mean in, like, the nice way, like, it's got beaches and, like, resorts and stuff. It's like, come on, man, like, we're, yeah, the, people are not taking it seriously in parts of, of the province. It's one of those things where I always feel the need to be like, you know. <laughs> you Look, you're not wrong, but at the same time, Vancouver is not British Columbia. I got, I don't know what people are up to in, in Delta and Surrey and stuff like that. I just, you know, out here in Vancouver, I think we're, we're taking our, uh, we're taking it somewhat seriously over here, but... Then again, how would I know? You know, I, I haven't been outside and except to go grocery shopping in quite some time. Okay, things are getting a little spiced. I don't see a long piece, so let's let's embrace uh, change here. Okay, this is it's it's too much. The the dogs are circling. Oh, no. Okay, this is actually okay. Goodbye. That, dude, we, we gotta figure out... It, it's gonna... I mean, there's been bad play. Uh, to be honest. But... 